I'm not sure if I like this background, but I did want to show off my skirt. So yes, that is why I sat down like that. Um, don't mind the tag. I'm, maybe I'll just turn it off now. All right, I really suck at remembering what to say when I'm filming, but I forgot to mention that I did start to use a platform to schedule a call with me for any mentorship. So I've offered it before, but never really got around to it because it was hard to schedule something. But I used Heidi Cal now, and I'll have that linked below. And I, you know, you can schedule a call with me for 15, 30, an hour, all up to you. Um, I really enjoy talking to you guys. So it's really interesting to actually get face to face time with you guys. I, I really enjoy hearing your story, why you want to get started and really helping out like I, I truly truly enjoy it so um yeah just uh book a call with me if you're interested and that's all i want to say so back to the video so i just got a new ring light and that's why the lining is like i don't know if it looks too artificial but my apartment doesn't have the best lighting like i'm literally underground and literally my apartment's like parasite like that movie when they live underground so i mean i'm not that low but i just don't get a lot of lighting the best lighting i have is on that side of the apartment and I just want to change like the view up. Um, ignore this cord. This is this is my office setup. I'm getting used to this, but anyway, I don't want to drag out this intro too long. So thank you for subscribing if you're new here. I got a lot of subscribers from TikTok, I believe. So thank you guys. I appreciate you following me. And I know a lot of you want to know about my loan signing journey and just how to get started. So you can see my videos on that. Um, and as for my YouTube, I, I'm kind of just trying different things out. Like I, I don't want to stay in this niche because, you know, no, I'm more than just a signing agent. I don't want to box myself in as that. So that's kind of like my qualm with, um, with YouTube really or any social media. Because first and foremost, I am just a human being. I don't want to box myself in or subscribe to just one identity. So yeah, that's just the easiest way of putting it. I know that sounds really annoying and very humble brag. Brag. And, you know, I guess that vibe. Maybe it's a little cringy, but anyway, we're just gonna ignore that. All right, so today I'm gonna talk about my income for the month of June. And for June, I mean, June was pretty awesome. Like, I mean, it's summertime, you know, so I feel like maybe because I graduated a few years ago, I still have that like mindset, like summers for free time, friends and the beach. And um, I kind of just took it as that. And I took a week off to go to New York and that was amazing. Um, and it was great because my friend was staying there. I didn't have to pay for a place to stay, which makes traveling a lot cheaper. The day before I left to New York, I got a car, which I was a little, not gonna lie, I was just very impatient. I just wanted my car. So um, I saw a listing for a car. It was brand new and it was a brand new listing. Um, my car is a 2017 Lexus CT. I love it. She's so cute. I don't know if it's a he or she yet. Maybe just gender neutral, but I love it. Like it's just, I, it's so embarrassing now that I think back at like the videos I posted with my Honda Civic and I'm not shitting on my Honda Civic because I love that thing. That's my baby. But as I'm driving, like sometimes you can see me like, like go up and down, like as I'm going through speed bumps and I'm like, the ghetto i can't i really can't um so now i don't have to go through that anymore my car is smooth sailing and that's why i got a lexus because they are just smoother cars and smoother experience luxury experience on a toyota dime you know so i enjoy it i love it um so i can i can make a video about that too because i did film some content there at the dealership even though they didn't want me to back to work i didn't work that much obviously because i had that in mind and it's summertime i feel like i've kind of just like let things go and i'm not so like hard pressed on myself about making like 10k like that was my goal for the longest time and since i've done that i'm like I'm not so worried about money or like making money because I finally feel like I am at a place where I'm living within my means. Like my rent is pretty low. My car payment is pretty low. I don't buy, like, I mean, I shop at Goodwill for the most part. Um, I, I don't just, I just don't spend a lot of money besides on food. I, food is definitely my problem. Um, so I'm just trying to keep my lifestyle somewhat the same, except for travel. Like I do enjoy traveling and just, I like spending my money on experiences. So, um, with that in mind, like I know how much I have to work and how much I don't have to, you know, I'm doing this for a life balance, a work life balance. And this is exactly what this job is allowing me. So let me, I'm looking at, I'm referring to my computer. So I actually didn't miss like a full week of work now that I'm looking at my calendar. I only missed like Thursdays and Fridays um, between the middle of the week. So that wasn't too bad. Um, 
I made $5,100, so that's pretty good. I made $5,100 and that was within 30, I did 30 signings, so that's not bad. And um, I, I'm not, I'm really not upset at that. Like maybe that's like a 60K salary, except my taxes aren't as bad as like an employee. So I would say after taxes, maybe a 75K salary, which still isn't bad. I can live within this, this income other than that though i do i've never shared this with you guys before and i was i was a little hesitant but i think somebody a few of you who have asked about my other streams of income and i'm not i'm not gonna gatekeep anything or like how i make my money so um i do want to share with you and by gatekeeping i mean like youtube like a lot of people don't want to encourage others to start a youtube channel so like if that's what you want to do too to make money like do it with that um let me get into my youtube income so i don't know if i ever told you guys but i was monetized my first month um on youtube like i i think it was monetized end of december i started my channel in mid-november so I was monetized pretty fast and and i have you guys to thank for that because if you guys weren't here watching my journey i probably would have stopped filming by now because i i'd be a little hurt not gonna lie like i'd be a little butt hurt and intimidated i just wouldn't feel motivated to post anything if nobody was really watching for my youtube income i think by my first month of youtube i made 122 dollars i'm looking at that right now and for the longest time i didn't cash out my youtube my adsense because for one, I had to put my tax information and I was waiting to start my business. So that took about a month. And then I kind of just never got around to it because I was like, I want to see my my income, my YouTube paycheck grow. Around May, I think that's when I finally like put my tax information in so I could get the money out. And at that point I was at a thousand dollars, I think a little over a thousand. And so that's what I got paid from YouTube. And it was nice to see it finally stack up. So monthly, I would say on average, I was making about $300 or I have been making $300 a month on YouTube just from AdSense alone. I don't do brand deals because I'm not really there yet and I, I do have my own business. So I think that day that day will come when it does, cool. Um, oh, actually I did do, I worked with Weeble, but which is pretty a big, a big brand, but I wasn't getting paid or anything. So, I mean, I was getting paid in free stocks, but that's another thing I didn't really, not that many people signed up with it. So, and I didn't want to push something, especially when my channel's so new. So, um, yeah, I am, I'm claiming sponsorships though. If anybody wants to, any brand out there wants to sponsor, please do so. I am up for that. Cause you know, your girl's going to get her coin for the month of May because YouTube pays you like a month out. So in June, from YouTube, I got paid $408. That's the most I've ever made from AdSense. And thank you guys, thank you guys for watching. That means, it really means a lot. And so I don't know if I'm allowed to share this. I'm gonna share it with you guys anyway. But um, my CPM, I don't know the difference between CPM and RPM, but my CPM can range from, I think my lowest CPM, which is only on like one video is $12. My highest is $54, which is a, a crazy range like if you think about it 54 is really really high for cpm like that i don't hear i've never heard of anybody getting that much so i'm like kind of excited and proud about that um also some of my videos i think whenever i talk about my job because it is a finance thing i get paid more so people in the finance realm or space of youtube end up getting a higher cpm usually i'd say about 30 20 dollars which on average i think that is where my videos end up getting 33 is what i usually see so that's pretty cool especially for somebody like me that just started my youtube in october so that's really exciting i just wanted i wanted to share that with you guys because i don't mean it to brag but like to show you to be transparent but to also encourage anybody else that wants to start a youtube channel because i don't want to just promote like my loan signing like that job or that business because there's so many other ways you can make money and you know i wish i knew this when i was younger or actually believed in myself to do something like this if you have a youtube channel in mind or like you want to start to talk whatever just do it just just start ignore the haters don't listen to anybody do you boo all right also so i do have um i do have an affiliate link with amazon i know i don't want to support jeff bezos okay but it's just you know when like you have to just because it's like cheaper and because it's a business it's like i need to cut costs as much as i can so that's where i get some of my supplies i don't want a minute i'm sorry i do have affiliate links to those things and i usually post them at in my bio for um each video because i know people are curious if somebody clicks on it and they don't buy the item if they do end up buying something else like from clicking on that link um i still get a cut from that and that could be like maybe 12 cents on like a five dollar item like somebody's bought groceries so i can see what you buy so if 
if you are wondering. I know somebody got some collard greens with my affiliate link, so it's kind of it's kind of funny what I can see. A lot of you guys buy groceries on Amazon, which I never thought of. But anyway, thank you for that because I am getting paid. So um, I mean, two cents, five cents, whatever. Um, Still, nonetheless, I am very thankful. So thank you to anybody that has clicked on any of my affiliate links. It really means a lot. Um, I think like on average, I was getting paid maybe, maybe like 30. The Amazon affiliate links, like the pay from that really, really ranges. But last month I got paid like a little over a hundred, like maybe 110. And I think that's the most I've ever made from my Amazon affiliate links. So thank you guys for that too. That means a lot. And again, like I'm not pushing my affiliate links. If you don't want to use it, I don't, I do, it's okay, you don't have to. Um, same with my, my loan signing system, link the course that I took with Mark Wills. I list it in my bio, but I don't push, I never really push the course, because again, I want you to find what works for you. Never, never feel obligated to click on any of my links or any of that, I just, just wanna be transparent with that. All right, so for the month of June, my total income with my, you know, loan signing business and YouTube AdSense and affiliate, Amazon affiliate links, I made a total of $5,510.89. So please ignore my boyfriend. Um, yeah, I don't think that's bad. I know it's not like what I was making before, like the 10K, the 9K, but I'm really happy and my life is really balanced. I'm doing what I want, I'm traveling, I'm traveling too much, but um, you know, I really just enjoy it. And I, I, I appreciate it, like really from the bottom of my heart, like you guys have also helped me out by watching my YouTube and my TikToks, like it's crazy. I didn't, I never thought any of this was possible. So um, I just wanna end this video with saying thank you guys. Yeah, that's it. So I'll see you guys later, bye.